Here we are, Tri-State Arena Cross day two. Already got police cars. I don't know if I've already missed an incident today or what, but seems to be a good sign for the entertainment that may lie ahead. We indeed do have police on the premises. Altercations early in the day. Tonight's the night. Bro, triple crown, three mains, $5,000 to the winner. I think it's 2,500 per second, 1,500 per third. Y'all already know you can't beat big, big money, small track. Barn Cross National. Hell yeah, ain't got nobody sitting or kneeling around here. It's race time. Out front, we've got our featherweight, Monster Army in second. We got the 214, Austin Fortner with an immediate return from injury. I love to see it. Walk past for the lead, a great move on off. On a super mini that's doing the 125 dirty. On the 150 rev box, mid whoop section, end nose. Last turn, he can taste the finish and he goes down. Panic sets in, red plate, points implications at stake. Oh, they stack it, hangs on to it. Oh, but stalls the whip. Oh, one down after the finish. Red flag is out. Send them back to the gate and re-rack them. Looks like my boy's up and okay though. Great to see. We got red flags out. We got them piled up in the background. Pandemonium here in the 65 open. Oh, we're tangled up. This photographer out here is brave. I salute you, ma'am, for getting out there and getting the shot. Ain't no way am I standing in between lanes out here just to get center punched by one of these kids while looking through a lens. Don't even see it coming. Sounds like a terrible way to go. I would rather go on my own accord, hitting a wall or looping out over one of these jumps. No choice. Here we go. We got e-bikes on course. It's Elon Jr. out front, followed by Elon Jr. Elon Jr. rounding out the podium in third. Just makes a pass on Elon Jr. I can't keep up with the action. We got split start. Some go left, some go right, some don't know where to go. Close call. Looks back to see if anyone saw it. Yeah, we all did. Taking a chunk of the jump while the train spoke. Second tire pressure on course. Couldn't be bothered to do it back in the pits. Still a track size. This guy stepped it up for my boy in the t-shirt. He's t-shirt and jeans. He's full clothes kit. All he's missing is a pair of tennis shoes. Work boots would also be applicable. Wow, right over the top of the berm. And they pile it up in the full turn. Practice. Not even gonna wait till the race until we lay people out. Just do it now. Ooh, head plant into the side of the finish line. Wow, goes for the takedown in practice. We got people sitting on the finish line. Carnage everywhere. Whoa, you cannot go that way, Brownie. Wheelie boy down the start. 
No boots, no gloves, jeans, sweatshirt. This is Moto, baby. Here we go, t-shirt, whole shot. No, he backs down early. Oh, and he hangs it inside. Hangs in gear. Chicken wing from our t-shirt. T-shirt versus the 45 red plate, Damon Bradshaw. Oh, t-shirt aggressive in the second. Oh, washes the front. A tribute to Marty Dobler. Wow, rides the front wheel. And then rides the back wheel. This dude hates being on two wheels. Should ride a unicycle. We've got a late entry. He's trying to hit the real first turn. It's blocked off, brother. Gonna have to take a right. No gloves from this guy either. What is it with the guys up here with the no gloves? And now we're stuck on the finish line. What a disaster. We've also got no goggles and the helmet is not even buckled. No need for any of that. Oh my gosh, what a close call. They both avoid each other. Oh, we're dragging the cover with us. We got Josh Grant, Anaheim 1, 2009 spec on the 07. Now what is that going to do to him, Jeff? If he loses the rear brake, oh, that is wrapped around the right side. Oh, no! Oh, they jam it in there, and they all stay up. I love the agility out of these sea riders. We got a bucket in the whoops. Oh, another one. He stays up, though. They always stay in it. We got the Vicky Gold approach to step on, roll off. Vicky's done more than me in Supercross, though, straight up. Slides him around, you're safe. Freeway battle royale for C-Class Supremacy. Oh, he's gonna go from third to first. Oh! Down in a cloud of dust. Ooh! The rhythm section has been taken about all weekend. Whoa! Ghost rides the whip into the leader. Yes! No footer again! Oh! Flying W! He's up and off the track. Knights the front, hangs on. Digging to the checkered flag. Who's it gonna be? What a move! That's heart right there. Oh, 
Same top three as main number one, but a different order. Kilbarger three, Sewell second, and Mages with the win. Gonna be between Sewell and Mages, main three for five thousand dollars. Freaking KX two fifty two smoke. This thing is sick. And we're in the plan on no choice. I approve, brother. Whoa! Accidental wheel tap. Oh, knocks him right to the dirt. He's upset visibly. Oh, another accidental wheel tap. Jeez, oh, dude, he's jumping like I did in my last video. Decided to risk it, bought some raffle tickets. Shocker, I lost. Can't even race or win a freaking raffle. We got a fist bump for the past the like six. Oh, leader down, head in the dirt. Picking the bike up. This is what we like to see. We like to watch them remount and get back in it. Oh, they come together, they're both down. A rough race for the seven. Only four people on the track, two down. Do not know oh, does the Burkeen buck all the way through the loop. Patented move. Baltimore down the Oh, Forkner! Oh, my. 
my god! This is a red flag immediately. Literally no choice. Whoa, calm it down, boys. Just come to a halt. Take it easy. Our downriders are up and okay and walking back to the pits. I lied. One of our downriders is back on the gate in true gladiator fashion. Another very brave videographer. Dude, you are way too close for comfort. You're going to get rocked. Podium of Sewell with the win, Mages two, Kilbarger with a third. Boys, we're on it tonight. Great racing. What an ugly announcer. Uh, hey, are you done talking yet, man? I'm not tired of hearing your voice. <laughs> I'm, I'm tired of talking, Matt. I'm tired of talking. Tri State Arena Cross, Triple Crown. She's done and dusted. Headed back to the whip. About ready for an all night drive home, getting home the wee hours in the morning, but. It's the price you gotta pay when you wanna watch the action and get home to your bed the same night. No choice. Quick 2.30 a.m. gas fill up and the mandatory coolant fill up. And we're ready to finish this thing out. It's just a little bit past 4 a.m. Content never sleeps and apparently neither do I. Out here in the back roads, my favorite section of the drive, the on-road slalom course, S-turns. Stoked, stoked to be doing this part of the drive at this hour where there's nobody out here. Last time I came through here, 
had some crackhead trying to run me off the road. If you ain't ever drove all night to get to a race or leaving a race, then you just ain't core. Changed my mind. Similarly to every moto at the National this past summer, I'm starting to fade here towards the end, but we got the deer population keeping me on my toes. Only got an hour left. We can do this. Finally made it back to the home base. About petered out at the moment. It's actually only 514, so really not even too bad. But yeah, time to go inside and sleep until the PM hours of today. And yeah, thank y'all for watching. She was action packed, and I'll catch y'all next weekend. Tennessee Arena Crash. Stay tuned.